tapping goings today to see if we can manage to get rid of those a little bit more. So if you're not on mute, can you press mute for me so we don't hear your budgie in the background? That's great. So get yourself lying down on your back, get yourself nice and comfortable. We're going to start stretching out your legs up in the sky, lengthen through those lovely legs. Now get those legs nice and high and we're going to go circling around. We go stretching at the hamstrings to start us off. Now wrap your strap around your hands because we're going to pull against that strap in a minute to start getting our arms working a bit more. Breathing in, breathing out, really pushing the heel into the ceiling. Nice and high and around we go. Lovely. Nice, guys. Now, even in this position, I want you to try and pull your elbows down to the mat. Create some warmth between your shoulder blades. Really pull the elbows down to the mat and use those elbows to pull down as you're circling around. Take any tension out of your face and out of your neck and jaw. Take a big breath in. And breath out, shh, round we go. Good. Now holding it there for a second, we're going to bring the arms out to the side and holding it there, push the heel into the ceiling. Keep your elbows and wrists in a straight line and pull your hands down towards the floor. Pull into the back of your shoulders and release. And again, lift the heel high and pull those arms down behind you. So you've got really you've got two things going on at once. You've got your hamstrings on a stretch and you've got the back of your shoulders and arms working hard. Hold, hold, hold. You should be shaking with the effort. Well done. And release. Marvellous. Let's swap legs. So the other legs in the sky. Push the heel into the ceiling. And again, pull the elbows down towards the mat. Push the elbows down into that mat. And we're going to go little circles around. We go stretching out those hamstrings in preparation. Big breath in through your nose, out through your mouth. Keep pulling the elbows down to the mat. Try and squeeze a pencil between your shoulder blades. All the way around we go. Breathing in, breathing out. Very good. Nice, guys. Lovely. And now widen those arms, push the heel up, and pull the arms down toward the floor. Get the wrists in line with the forearms. Pull the hands right down towards the floor. And release. And again, push the heel up. Pull those arms right down towards the floor. Bring it into the triceps and into the back of the shoulder blades. Should be shaking with the effort. Remember, breathing in, breathing out. Breathing in, breathing out. Well done. And release. Think back. Nicely done, guys. Well done. Okay. Coming from there now, I'm going to take the strap. We're going to pop it just behind our head. So double up your strap if you've got a double one. And just pop it behind your head. Take a nice breath in. We're going to come up with the strap and drop our head into that strap. Lift up a little bit higher with the chest. Drop your head down, strong tummy, and scooping back down. So you're using your triceps to give yourself a little bit of a help. Don't drag on the neck. Get your ribs off the mat. Strong tummy, and releasing down. Nice breath in, and scooping up. Look at your belly button, strong, strong. And releasing, two more. Nice breath in. Coming up through, drop your head into the strap and lift, 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 strong tummy. And let's do one more nice breath in and pull up. Look at your tummy, head soft in the strap, ribs forwards two more inches and releasing down. Nicely done, guys. Now we're going to get the strap, we're going to bring it in front of our chest so it's parallel um, to our shoulders. Wrap it around your hands if you can. Now keep strong with the tummy. Drop your belly down into the mat. Pull the arms open outwards into the strap. Keep your wrists in line. We're going to lift it into the sky. Don't force it if it's painful at all. And scope back down towards your knees. Your tummy's working all this time. Do not let it switch off. And scoping down. Very good. Breathing in. Into the sky. Pull the strap open. And scoping back down. Lovely. And into the sky stretching and scooping. Let's do one more, nice breath in. Up you go, stretch and scooping back. Nice guys. Now the elbows are on the mat and the palms are facing each other. Pin your elbows into the mat, get your ribs down and in and pull open into that strap. Lengthen the top leg into the sky. Now keep pulling the strap apart. We're going to go little circles in the sky, keeping that lovely leg in the sky. Breathing in, breathing out. Keep pulling into the side of those shoulder blades. 
Where we're going, guys, keep pulling. I'm just going to take you into a bit more mute. There we are. So stretching those legs into the sky and rolling around you go. Rolling around, that's it. That's the one. Just going to mute a few more people. Great. Nice. So round we go into the sky still with those legs. Nice. Now we're going to swap legs. We're going to get the other leg into the ceiling. Other leg into the sky. Stretch that leg nice and long into the sky. That's it. Okay, so here we are. The strap is in, is in lateral rotation, so elbows tucked into the mat. Pull the hands open outwards, lengthen one leg into the ceiling. We're going little circles going round into the sky. Breathing in, breathing out. Breathing in, breathing out. Little circles going round. Keep pulling that strap apart, elbows tucked into your sides. And scooping round, let's go three more. Scoop around, lovely guys, keeping everything else nice and steady. Scoop around, very good, and releasing back down, nice. Now pop the strap to the side, we might need it again a little bit later. Okay, coming from there, we're gonna get your hands in front of your knees, we're gonna go roly-poly, roly-poly, and popping up into sitting on the mat with the feet nice and wide in front. We're gonna slide the hands down towards your ankles, draw your head right over the top of it, and just keep yourself a little pull through just to open up your low back muscles. That's it. There you go. Just hold that position there. Drop your nose right down towards your knees. And scooping back up tall again. Nice breath in. Over the top you go. Stretching over the top. Elbows wide. Drop your chin down. Feel a nice stretch in that low back. Lovely. Breathing in and out. And scooping back. Well done, guys. Now we're going to take our little weights. If you've got whatever you've got, we're going to hold them there. We're going to do a little mini roll down, so a strong belly. We're going to scoop down into the tummy. Just engage your tummy muscles. Hold it there. We're going. One, two, three, four, five. Reach forwards all the way through, nose down. Scooping down as far as you feel comfortable. Hold it. One, two, three, four, five. And reaching forward, strong, lengthen through. Now we're going to go for robot arms, so we're curling down. Here we are. Robot arms. Scoop two, scoop three, scoop four, scoop five, and reaching forwards. Let's do that one again. Coming down, strong. And here we go. And one, and two, and three, and four, and five, and scooping back. Now we're going to do rejecting a tree. So go down just a little bit again. Hands are in front. Nice breath in. We open the arms. We close the arms. We open. Strong tummy. Breathing in. Breathing out. One more. Breathing in. Breathing out. And we scoop all the way forward right through the front. We're going to do one more of those. Scooping down. And here we go. And one. And two. And three. And four. Strong tummy. Two more. Looking good. Strong with the tummy tuck. Lovely guys. And coming forward and reaching through the front. Bet those beans and, and tins are feeling heavier now. <laughs> really a little bit heavier. Well done, guys. Now we're going to pop the weights to the side. We're going to come up onto all fours. So let's get yourself comfortable on all fours. Open up those fingers nice and wide. Now really own those fingers. Pull the power up into your armpits. Get your knees back a little bit further than you would usually. Take a breath in. We're going to come down with the nose towards the mat. Elbows tucked in and scooping back. And drop your nose to the mat and scooping back. And nose down. If you're supersonic and strong, you can go into a full press up. You can go into a full press up or even a little mini press up. Otherwise, keep your knees on the mat and you're going to go for a little one like that. Scoop. Let's go for three more. Nose to mat. Press through those bingo wings. Three more. Last one. Well done, guys. Now, taking one hand, one weight in the hand, elbow tucked into the side. Draw your tummy under so your tummy's really working for you and squeeze back. For 10, three, four, five. Now, you really own the hand on the mat as well. Those arms on the mat are working as well, just as much. Into the back of those arms, last two. Stretch, stretch, very good, swap hands. Again, really own your fingertips on that arm. Pull the power into your armpits. Elbow tucked in and behind you. Nice and high with that elbow. And three. Looking good. Keep your tummy drawn under. And four. Lovely. And five. And 
six and seven and eight and nine and ten. Oh, well done, guys, and on to the mat. Nicely done. Now we're going to come from there. We're going to come onto our tummy. So lying down on your tummy, you're going to get your forehead down on the mat. Now squeeze your feet together, squeeze your knees together, and let's get our hands down beside our bottom. Grow long through the top of your head. Open up your clavicles and squeeze your bottom really firmly. Lift your belly off the mat. Reach the hands down towards your ankles. And we're going to pump those arms in and out. Breathing in, two, three, four, five, and two, three, four, five. Squeeze your heels, squeeze your knees, squeeze your bottom. Grow long, two, three, four, five, and two, three, four, five, in, two, three, four, five, out, two, three, four, five, in, two, three, four, five. Nearly there, couple more. Breathing in, two, three, four, five, out, two, three, four, five. Ooh, well done, guys. And releasing back, nice. Now both arms are going above our head if we can. Arms are nice and long into the sky. Now lengthen through the top of your head. You're going to do a little bit of swimming, but do not sink in the low back. So lift your low back off the mat slightly. We're going to lengthen the right arm and left leg away from the midline. Grow long, bring it out to the side slightly. And releasing back down. And the opposite to the other side. Left arm, right leg, lengthen through. And release. Now when you lift one, Push the opposite one into the floor. So really push the other one down into the mat. And release. And again, lengthen through. Push the other one down to the floor. And release. Couple more. Stretch long. Lovely. And lengthen. Breathing in. Push the other one into the ground. Last one. Oh, well done, guys. And coming from there onto all fours, let's do child's pose after that. Open your knees wide. Bring your bottom down onto your heels and stretch your arms long and away. Tuck your chin in, nice breath in and out. Stretch those triceps. Let's take both hands over to one side there, now right over there, stretch through the waist. Very nice, and right over the other side, and over there we go, and stretch through that side of your waist. And nice breath in and out, and back in the middle. Now opening up your fingers nice and wide, we're going to go into a little mini down dog. So get yourself comfortable, we're going to get the hands nice and wide, tuck your toes under, and we're going to lift up into the down dog. Look down at your knees, push your heels away, draw that chin down, and let's walk through, drawing the heel down, drawing the heel. Now your arms are working in this position, obviously, keep the power in your armpits, don't let your wrists throw too much of a bend. Nice, good, and down we come again into a little child's pose. Now we're going to see if we can do a little leg pull this time, guys. It's tricky, so don't go too big with it. We're coming up onto our hands again. Hold those arms. We're coming up into our down dog again. Hold that position. Take your right foot into the sky, into the ceiling. Point it into the ceiling. Push your other heel to the floor. And again, and again. Swap. Hold those arms. Other leg in the sky. And stretch, stretch, stretch. Yay! And down we come. And down we come all the way and give those little leg, little hands a little stretch. Nicely done, guys. Well done. Now we're going to come from there. We're going to come into a nice little bit of a cross leg position in front of you, if you can. If that's uncomfortable, sit with your legs out in front of you. Okay, going to go side bending. Left hand on the mat and really push that hand as if you're making a handprint on the floor. Over you go into the side bend, stretch. Big breath in and out. And scooping back. And over there again, stretch the other side. Nice. One more each way, right up and over. Look under your armpit, stretching out the back. And one more the other way, right over there. Great. And down we go. Nice, guys. Now we're going to take our strap once more. We're going to go into a nice little bridge. So for the bridge today, you can have a little soft cushion if you want to, otherwise just have no, no cushion at all. I'm going to ask you to take your strap and place it in front of your hips. So with your arms nice and long, feet hip width apart, you're going to lift your hips into the sky. But you're going to use the hips and the band as a resistance. So lifting the bottom into the sky, pull down behind you with your hands, lengthen your hands towards your ankles, and releasing back down. Nice breath in. Lifting up, curling up into it like you would usually, lengthen the neck. Pull your hands against your hips. 
Pull down, down, down into those triceps and releasing back. Nice breath in and lifting up into it. Use the hips. Pull, pull, pull and release. Two more. Nice breath in. Lift, lift, lift. Squeeze through those hips and releasing down. One more. Nice big one. Lifting into the sky. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Well done, guys. And releasing back down. Oh, very good. Now we're going to take our little weights while we're there. So the weights are in our hands. Nice breath in. Now all about keeping the tummy going as well, guys. Keep your tummy down and in and firm. We're going to bring the arms into the sky. Elbows are up into the sky. Weights to the floor, weights to the ceiling. Keep your tummy working. Squeeze. Squeeze. No arching in the back. And squeeze, very good. And squeeze, last two. Nice. Well done. Now the elbows are wide, the weights are on the chest. We're going to punch to the ceiling. And punch to the ceiling. Nice, two more of those. Punch and punch. Now we're opening wide to the side and pull it back in front of your tummy. Open wide. Tummy working all the time. Ribs are down, connected. Scooping in. Scooping out. We're going to add the legs. Here we go. Lengthen one leg away. Scooping in. Swap legs. Lots to think about. Get your brain going. Scooping in. Scoopy in, last couple looking good. Scoopy in, scoopy in, strong, strong. And last one, and we pull back in and we release. Woo! Well done, guys, really nice stuff. Now we're going to come from there, we're going to come and sit up. We're going to do a nice little saw. So sitting up on our mat, get your legs each side of that mat. Grow tall through your chest, arms are in a T. We're going to twist all the way around to the little toe. Back pinky low. Stretch, stretch. Stretch, grow tall, twist, lengthen, 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 two more, right around, stretch, 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 grow tall, and stretch, stretch, stretch. Nicely done, guys. Now we're going to come up into high kneeling. If you've got sore knees, you might want to try, um, you can actually try standing up. Or if you really want to, you can actually sit cross-legged on your mat, okay? So I'm gonna come into a little semi-kneel myself into this position here, and we're gonna have our weights in our hands, okay? Coming from there, into the biceps, and we squeeze, and we squeeze. Now keep your posture, keep your tummy tucked in. You can either be high kneeling or standing, wherever you think you need to do for this, and scoop, scoop, and scoop. Now don't forget those arms working, and last two of those. Nice toned arms for the summer. Very good. And then we're going to lean forward slightly, elbows tucked in, and we're stretching behind. Like we're skiing along a flat piece of piece, shushing yourself along, right back behind you. And scoop, scoop. Very good. Scoop, and scoop. Last two. Very nice. Very good. Now we're like a chicken. Here we go. We're going to grow tall, shoulders down your back, out to the side like a chicken. No tension in your neck. Scoop out. Lovely. Scoop out. These are for those deltoids, the little caps, your natural shoulder pads on each side of the ship, ship shoulders. And scoop. And scoop. Lovely. Two more. Scoop. And scoop. Very good. And back in the center. Now into high flies. Hands are front. Lift to the chest. Lifting down. Lift to the chest. Well done, guys. 
chest now. Coming supine once more, over onto your back. Hand weights if you want to. We're going to go for a little, um, little um, dead bug. So arms are in the sky. Nice breath in. Keep that tummy down. We're going to lift the opposites away from the midline. The other arm staying steady. Pull it back. And swap. If you're feeling strong enough and your back is okay, you can go for the opposites in the sky. Stretch and scoop. And stretch and scoop. And stretch and scoop. Oh, that added weight really helps that tummy focus. Scoop. Last two. Lovely. Last one. Very good. And release it. Marks. Now there's one bottle from our side. So over onto your side. Here we go. Bottom arm can be under your head. And it's lengthen both legs down the mat. Strong with the belly button. Tuck your belly under. We're going to lift both arm and leg into the sky. And scoop. And up. And scoop. And hold up. Really low with purpose. If you feel comfortable, you can grow long and lengthen both legs off the mat to start off with. And lift up through your chest as well. Lovely. Lifting those deltoids. Strong side muscles. Last two. It's tricky. You're doing well. Earn your coffee. Well done. And down we go into open book. Head on your block. Arms are out. Now do not drop it on your head. Keep it low down. Let it help you. Careful if you have a sore shoulder. Round the bend we go. Ah, nice. And pull it back in the middle. And again, round the bend. Stretch. If you want to grow along with the other leg, grow along with the other leg. Open up your chest. And use your tummy to pull that weight back in the front. And more. Round you go. Lengthen through it. Engage your ribs to pull the weight back in. Lovely, guys. Nicely done. Let's go around the other side. Oh, the sun's coming out. I don't know where you are. My sun's coming out. That's good. Down we go. Lengthen both legs. Arms low. You can see your toes when you look down. Bottom hand on the floor. We're lifting up. Squeeze through the waist. Squeeze through the waist. Just your shoulder height. Use your waist muscles. Into the arms. Nice. Now, if you feel comfortable, you can go a little bit higher. And you can hold it up there, both legs long. And here we are. Scoop. The legs are hovering just off the floor if you can. Lovely. Last couple. And scoop. And scoop. And scoop. Well done, into open book. Where's my little pillow? There it is. Little pillow coming in, and here we are, arms long in front of us. Lift up into the sky, right around the corner. Open up your chest. And draw back in front of you. And round you go again, stretching round. Draw back in. If you want to lengthen the top leg, go along with the top leg away. And round, going long, and really use your tummy to pull that weight right back in. Let's do one more. Round you go, stretch, 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 and draw back in. Very nice. Over onto your back, and you're going to have your two weights now back in your hands. Nice breath in. Okay, we're going to go from there into a single leg stretch. Just do what you can with this one, guys. Don't go too high if your neck is sore. We're going to lengthen both legs up into the sky. We're going to lift our chest into the ceiling. We're going to reach the ankles with the weights. We're going to go around in circles and come back down, curl into a little ball. Breathing in. Lift up those ribs. Reach towards your ankles, circling around and scooping back. And reach and round, strong tummy. And down we go. And reach and round. One more. Nice breath in. And we reach and we go round. And we go scooping. Oh, well done, guys. That was great. Really good stuff. Now, we're going to come from there. We're going to come into a little mermaid to finish off with. So let's come into nice wide knees on your mat. Hands on your knees. Grow tall. Elbow down on the floor. Reach across the mat with those arms. Big stretch around the bend. Nice breath in and out. And coming back up, we 
pull in our shin, we open up through the waist muscles, stretching away. And down we go again, reaching into the corner all the way over there. Drop your head down. And scooping back and over you go. Nice, let's swap sides. Other side over there, open up your knees again. Elbow on the mat, reaching into the corner, stretch out the chest. Coming back, we grow tall, pull against your elbow. And down we go, lengthen through it, over to the corner. And back and stretch. Nicely done, guys. Now we're just gonna finish off with a little stretch for our shoulders. You're gonna have your little strap for this one, and then we can do it sideways on, and you can sit cross-legged if you want to. Drop it over the back like you're what, drying your back with a towel and hold on to that strap with your hand behind. Now the front hand is going to lift up into the ceiling. Go gently, pull the other hand up into the sky and bring your elbow tucked under behind your back. Gently, gently, gently pull that other hand up into the ceiling. Open up your chest and release. Think back down and the arm comes down. Nice breath in again. And again, lift it up into the sky. Grow along with it, pull with the other hand in the ceiling. Nice breath in and out. And draw back in. Now we're going to swap sides so the other hand goes up in the sky and the other hand is down your back. Can you see me? Nice breath in. I'm going to lift up through it, pull it up into the ceiling, bring the other hand up into the sky. I need to make that a bit tighter. And pull your hand up your back. This is needed rotation of the shoulder. Sometimes we lose a bit of that. Into the sky. And releasing, and let's pull again into the sky, and releasing. Nicely done, guys. Well done. Well, my arms are feeling it anyway. I can feel I've really worked those triceps. You might be a little bit sore later on. Don't worry. It's just your triceps feeling the burn a bit. That was brilliant. Really good, guys. Let's say goodbye to our bingo wings. Well done. <laughs> Give yourself a big hug virtual hug. Well done, everybody. That was brilliant. Big kiss and have a great day. It looks like the sun's coming out. Well done.